everybody. I'm back um, with another capsule jigs unboxing. This is the second pack of the two that I've uh, that I was able to find at, at Target. Uh, with it was twenty four ninety nine plus tax. This is the I don't know the second series or a new series of capsule chicks called the Shimmer Surge Collection. So in this collection, you get two dolls. You get one exposed with a hair upgrade, and then you get uh, one mystery one uh, that could possibly be one of three boys in this collection. So I, I don't know how many of these packs exist. I was able to find two, but uh, and Blaze just wants to be in the way and be cute, huh, Blaze? But I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take the plastic off and we'll take a look at our first girl. And they're, and they're kind of in two separate boxes, even though they kind of went together. I don't know if they were an afterthought. It's weird. Um, they have their own little background box here. Let's get her out of here. First off, here's your purse. Let's see if I can get that to focus. So you have a almost a magenta pink type color for the purse. The purse has those uh, cyborg whatever like wiring and stuff through it for a design. And then it has a little like kink right here, which is weird, a little point. And then uh, the silver metallic paint that goes around the clasp area. And on the clasp, you can see that little symbol there, the little dial symbol. And here is our girl here. Uh, she's rocking a really super curly blue wig with a streak of um, light pink in the front. Her face is pretty cool. I don't know if you guys can see that, but she's got some yellow kind of makeup or tattoo that goes over her eye and under her eye on one side. Her eyes are blue, and then she has an open smile with like a mauve lipstick. You can see her teeth. She has that color. Um, it's like a light teal color that kind of represents the collection that she's from, the, the uh, Shimmer Surge. She has a full... Um, holographic dress with uh, gray detailing around the sides and around the middle. And that has that cyborg type design as well. Um, it's a really cool dress. I love it. And then we have these cute high heel Mary Janes that are done in a dark pink. The buckles themselves are done in are painted in metallic silver and then so aren't the heels in the sole part. Um, like all other capsule chicks. Uh, she has, I think, 14 points of articulation. So her head moves up and down. She has shoulder joints, elbow joints, wrist joints, uh, waist joint, so you can swivel her back and forth, thigh joints, knee joints, and ankle joints. So wait, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 points? 1, Let's forget this. Uh, 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 yeah, but uh, fourteen. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> I, I know I showed you in the last video, but I want to show you how cool these wigs are. So let's see if I can just take take it off without without turning off my camera. It's, oh, there we go. So it just pops off. It's it's in a uh, rubber. Sorry, rubber it has a rubber sole base, and uh, it's been sewn into that, and that pops on top of her head. And then her head is exactly the same as all the other heads, but it has this little piece right here that you actually pop on, and it's transparent. And, uh, let's see if I can pop that off there. See? It comes off, and then it's the same head, but, uh, it makes it so that you can make it round and pop the wig off. I think it's a genius design. But either way, let's go ahead and get into our mystery girl here. Now, I say mystery girl, but there's a possibility there could be a mystery boy, because it says, will you find the capsule boy? Now, I don't know how rare they actually are. I'm hoping that I find one, because, I I mean, at this point, isn't everybody hoping they'll find one? Let's see. Let's see what we have here, guys. So we got to pull this pre-cut hole out here. Grab out our lookbook, a.k.a. checklist, which I can never understand how they read. But uh, these ones are done a little bit different. I really love the artwork on them. Here's the bot boys. Here's the three we can get. One is a man bun. Now I wonder if they're wigs or if they're just the regular style um, 
maybe one of them is. And I wonder if you can get the wigs in the free one. I mean, in the free one. In the, the uh, mystery one. I'm having a little hard time here, guys. Sometimes it gets a little jammed. You're just going to give it a little bit of a, a jostle. Um, hmm. I think I got one this time. <laughs> Maybe. As our girl falls down. Come on now. Okay, we got one. Okay. Crack it open here. Oh, we gotta actually take off the tear strip before we do that. Get out of myself. Too excited here. Okay. Let's see. It's a soft bag, and I don't think it's the head. Ooh, I feel clothing in here, guys. Okay, let's see. Yes, we have clothing. I, I don't know if it's a shirt or a dress. Oh, it's the jumpsuit that I think I saw. On the oh, it's a boy! Guys, it's a boy. You know how I know? Look at look at this. Okay, let's see if it will work here. Look at the man chest. Can you guys see it? I'm so excited! Alright. Alright, alright, alright. What am I going to get now? I'm having such a hard time with this. This is the worst one. Alright. So it looks like it's a full jumpsuit for that one. And I'm pretty sure it's a boy. Uh, let me look at the back here. I thought I saw... Her. Oh no, it was in the book that I saw it, I think. I don't know. I think it's the man bun guy. I'm pretty sure it's the man bun. Well, maybe it's not. Maybe... Because I would think that if there's only three boys, that, um... The outfits are pretty much set. Don't you think? Let's see, guys. Okay, what do we have in this one? Okay, we have a comb. That is for our girl over here, I think. So the combs, so far, seem to be the same color. That color that's, like, you know, based on the summer, uh, the simmer, ugh, shimmer surge, which is that light teal. Then we have our sand top, and then we have a face here, guys. So our face has light blue eyes, and the lips are lined in a dark red lip liner, but the lips themselves are plain. We have our two stands here. I still think it's a boy. <laughs> Alright. So I'm pretty sure that the girls don't have flat chests. I mean, uh, like man chests. I see it in there, guys. <laughs> what are we gonna get, guys? We're still waiting for the hair. And we're still waiting for... Um, what is this? Pretty sure it's the man bun. Uh-huh. I think. It's weird, it's put together already. Okay. So it is a, oh, it is a light turquoise, kind of similar to the color that's signature to this line. And then it has like a bun on the top with, and then it has a little bit of um, shimmer streaks. So a little bit of metallic dark turquoise in the front and a little bit in the bun. So, oh, and we also have some sunglasses. Oh my gosh. Cool dude, guys. Cool dude. I am so excited. So if I never ever find any more of these surge ones, at least I was able to get my hands on a boy. Okay, and our next one. We're still waiting for some legs, guys. Some legs and I guess an accessory. Hmm, I wonder what this is. I wonder what guys come with for accessories. Well, we already have sunglasses. Oh, right, we need to find shoes for them, too. Um, uh, hmm. And you come with a man purse? Maybe this is actually a girl. Hmm. Okay. So we have um, some silver metallic boots with um, a strap that goes around them that almost looks like a spur, but where the spurs would be. So I can get this to focus. Our metallic blue. Huh. Dials, and then this is like a 
uh, tote bag here, guys. So we have a tote bag that has the dial on the front of it. And it's a little squished. It doesn't open. But, um, I guess button. This is interesting. <laughs> Alright. Pretty sure he's a boy, though. Okay. Our last one's gonna have our, our legs, probably. Alright. Right back. Wait, no, I got it. I got it, guys. All right. So this is gonna be our legs. We know that for a fact. Um, so we do have a bot boy. I wonder what B O T means. It's abbreviated. Like it's got it's got periods next to it. Like it means something. Boy on trend, probably. Let's see here, guys. Here is our legs. And they're just plain old um, naked legs. Botanity here. Alright, so let's get our boy together and we'll take a closer look at him. Okay, before I... Before I finish doing this, I just wanted to show you guys mine's defective. How so? There's two hands from the same side of the arm. I tried everything I could do to get it to fix itself, but, um, no. His hand's the wrong hand for this arm. <laughs> oh, man. That sucks. Oh, well, um, I'll finish getting him dressed. Okay, guys, so here's a look at our two, um, dolls that we got today. We have our capsule chick with the hair upgrade. And we have our boy bot with um, two of the same hands, with two right hands. I'm probably going to contact Moose Toys at some point um, and see if maybe they'll send me a replacement hand or something. Because as a collector, that's really, really going to bother me. But on the other aspect too of it, he might be more collectible because he's got a defective hand. I, I don't know. But it's it, me personally, it's going to bother me. So, um, But other than that, I think he's a really cool addition. I think he looks awesome. Um, you know, you, you gotta add the man bun in there somewhere in, in doll collections. And I think it's all also awesome that they give us a comb to go with uh, the girl that has hair. Uh, comment below. Let me know what you guys think. Have you guys picked up any of the capsule chicks from the series? Um, wh which ones did you get? Um, I don't know. Uh, do you like them? I, I like them, and I'm I, the only time I'll ever get, but I'm the only ones I'm going to get more of are ones that have new girls showing. Or boys, I don't know. Is there boys that have hair? I, I don't know. <laughs> if you like this video, um, go ahead, give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.